Hello friend, in this video I am going to discuss about transpose table column values inside Microsoft Power BI. So here I am using uh, Microsoft SQL Server, the source and here Adam database and this all our tables are there. So let's go to Power BI desktop, here Power BI desktop. Now here after click on transport data and here power query editor it's uh, open so there is nothing inside there so let's go here new source so connecting with the uh, sql server now here give the server name localhost you can give your pc name also and uh, since uh, add your Adam database are there so it's optional but uh, I recommend you you should, skip, you should give the database name and after applying this click on OK and uh, here you can uh, select uh, this all tables so here I'm going to select uh, or, or dpt table now click on OK so dpt table because uh, here I want to, to transpose so first I am going to show you the record inside dpt so this is the record inside dpt so 10, 20, 30, 40 that I want into the columns ok so here it's uh, come there now you need to go uh, transform and uh, about to group by use first row as a header that I discussed in my last video so let's uh, see here transpose so when you take the cursor on transpose so here you get the message transpose this table treating rows as a column and column as the rows so this rows that uh, go to the columns ok so let's uh, click on this and here you can see uh, it was uh, 10, 20, 30 it's uh, now in the uh, rows here this all uh, this all values is now rows uh, here this is the all now here after I don't want to uh, this uh, column column 1 column 2 so here you can uh, click there use and here you can see uh, 10, 20, 30, 40 it was in uh, it was in uh, uh, rows but now after applying use header so it's now in the uh, columns so here this is the record initial record or uh, table records and 10, 20, 30, 40 it's come into the header header or the columns like this uh, you can use this in any or uh, tables ok so here if I uh, so this is the dpt now here let's go to home and here if I select uh, this sql server once again and uh, keep the quickly now click on ok and this time I am going to select here countries departments so you need to ch click on this checkbox ok and uh, here if you want then you can select uh, multiple tables click on ok So candidates uh, processing. Now, if you want to transpose here or uh, this uh, column rows value into the column, so go to transform here. Click on transpose. So here this all. And uh, if you want to, if you don't want to uh, column one, column two, use uh, this column header. So here it's come there. And if you don't want to AD, ADV, AD assistance. So here you need to click this once again. So percent and here administrator, administrator here. Yeah. So this is about the jobs. If you want to see the records, right click on it, select thousand. 
so here this all this value is now rows after applying your transpose so it's now converted into the columns so they are uh, some sort duplicate now here you can see this all like this you can apply in the countries so countries here this is the reason id it's all some all duplicate and here this all are unique country name if you want you can uh, use transpose here also and uh, if you don't want to uh, this so you can use this uh, use as a header okay so here that country code and here Argentina and here too and uh, let's uh, use uh, this time department and here this is the department now uh, select here transports and uh, 10 20 30 it's all our come here so till or uh, 270 now if, if you want to here use header so if i click on so double header it's come there so it was so now if i don't want this to so here use first once again you need to click and here 10 20 30 40 it's all in the columns it's come there so 10 administrator 217 if you want then you can see the records on the department select here 10 administrator manager id this is the location id now here administrator marketing purchase id sales finance so here this all i think uh, human resource accounting shipping scroll down benefits and uh, contract if you want to make this administrator in the uh, columns header you can easily achieve by using used first row after that you can see this all now here after if i right click here this all remove empty value so if you don't want any empty value then you can remove easily and uh, here nulls are at this place so remove empty number here so here you can see empty value that removed and uh, here let's uh, click on the countries here so if you want to select some particular values like uh, if you don't want to uh, two click on ok so to that remove if you want then you can just uh, click on check here this is for sorting so you can use add here sort so there is nothing now let's uh, see departments so 10 20 30 that's all or so previously it was in uh, rows after applying transfer it's now comes uh, here on the columns so this is the simplest way we can achieve uh, rows into columns inside power B uh, query enter so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you